Do you keep your wine bottle corks or know somebody who does? I do, a lot of people do. But I will admit, sometimes I wonder what I'm doing with all of them here in a jar. Well, how about reusing them? Keep the sentimental value of all the celebrations, the friends you've had over while doing something cool and useful. I'm Loria Petrucci, this is Earth 911 TV. One of the easiest ways to use your corks in an awesome way is to make a trivet, you know, like a hot pad or even a coaster. Go to a hobby shop, pick up a circular embroidery hoop, put the corks in however you want to arrange them, then tighten the hoop. Glue a felt base on the bottom so it doesn't slide. It'll also keep everything exactly where you want it. Done! You could even paint or cover the hoop if you want to spice it up a bit. If you're throwing a party, this next one is fun. Have you ever seen those wine glass charms? They're the little charms you put on the stem of each glass, that way everyone knows which charm is theirs and no one gets confused by which glass to drink of. You know, it's the fancier version of taking a marker to a red Solo cup at a party. Well, here's what you do. Cut the cork to a size that's manageable for the glasses that you have. Try half an inch. By the way, the best way to cut corks is to steam them on the stove for about 10 minutes, then cut with a sharp knife. Otherwise, you might find that they split and crumble. Once cut and dried, use rubber stamps to mark each charm. You could use letters of the alphabet, or you could get animal stamps, make everyone choose their favorite animal, right? You could get holiday stamps, completely up to your imagination. Screw a small eye screw into the side of the charm to tie whatever kind of material you'd like into the glass. Another idea, you can take the wine corks to the outdoors since they're so moisture resistant. Get a few skewers and a marker. Mark the herbs, veggies, or flowers in your garden, skewer the cork, stick them in the garden, easy breezy. Or how about this one? This one is definitely for the more crafty among you, but fun for anyone. You can create little cork planters and attach magnets to them for your fridge. Super cute. Here's how. Gather corks, a glue gun, magnets, a steak knife, and succulent plants. Don't worry, these things are hard to kill. Carve out the center of the corks with a steak knife. Don't push all the way through though. Stop about three quarters of the way down. Hot glue the magnet to the cork. Push soil into the hole that you created. Now put a stem of the succulent into the soil and pack with soil. Enjoy. See, there are fun, cool ways to reuse the things that you already have. And all of these will cause your friends to swoon and say, oh, you're so smart for doing it. Now, if you're not particularly feeling very crafty or just have no time at all and still want something freaking awesome, check this patio set out. It's made up of 7,400 wine corks. Great for entertaining outdoors or just for your own enjoyment, knowing that you have the best outdoor tables out there. <laughs> check it out at the Earth 911 shop. What have you done to reuse and recycle? Not just wine corks, but what else? We'd love to hear your ideas in the comments below at earth911.com or follow the conversation at the Facebook page. We look forward to hearing from you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.